What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Jeff. I'm thinking we're going to go going back to another episode of the Saga Log. It's episode 248, and honestly, we're going to get some good stuff going because we have a totem. Yes, we're going to slay. We're going to do what we need to do, and it's definitely going to be so great that we're going to not die. 100%. We're definitely not going to die. We have Satan leading, so uh, yas. Uh, no, honestly, something bad's gonna happen, and I already know it, and we're already prepared for it, but it's whatever, right? And if you're prepared for the badness, then the badness can't affect you on Mount Hanakili. Hey, how are you? Do you see this mountain? It's like Mount Hanakili. So, also, for you guys that are wondering how the heck we got here without the school battles, I'll be 100% honest. I did the Stuffle Quest. <laughs> And then I forgot and did the library, right? Library stuff quest because library is just exposition we didn't need in the first place. It was like, oh my gosh, guys, like this is so crazy. And it's like, I, no, it's not. It, you all have seen it like 8,000 times. And then I did the stuff quest because why not? It's 15,000 freaking points. Like, why not? Dollars. And then I forgot I got enough never melt ice out of it actually, too. But yeah, so I forgot about that. So I apologize. That's my fault. And then the. School grunts were easy as school grunts are. They're just easy peasy lemon squeezy. Like desolate land, uh, Lorantis easy. <laughs> like it's pretty bad. Um, but you know it is what it is, and it's not like they could have necessarily like predicted that desolate land was a good or a bad ability for them. But it's fine. Okay, but we have. Pie duck as our encounter. I'll take a pie duck. Pie duck's not a bad Pokemon. Pie duck's an easy Pokemon to catch too. Maybe pie duck will hand us the uh, moonstone. <laughs> Everybody's like, "Shut up about the damn moonstone already." I'm like, "No." The more I talk about it, then I'll talk into fruition. At least I'm talking a good thing into fruition, right? Like that's a positive, right? Talking good things into fruition. We love talking good things and positive things into the universe. That's something we don't typically do, so... That's out of our realm of normality. Sorry. Um. Oh, that's right. We ran into a gold duck, too. Um, in the area that we were just at. Hi, Pie Duck. I can use my mouse to name you, girl. Pie Duck. I like how I'm just putting on chap chapstick. But it's fine. Pie duck, you have zoom lens and are reckless with skull. Ooh. Trick. Trick ain't bad. That's a way we can get some moonstone. <laughs> Yo, I can shut them. <laughs> I'm just waiting for y'all to be like done with me for the rest of the day. Bung club. Okay. Okay, let's go ahead and do our trial though. Oh, Gigalith. We have we, we have one of those currently on the team. So I'm excited for episode 250, y'all. It comes out soon and we already got our guest lined up for it, and I'm excited because she's been on the channel before. And it's not Joy. <laughs> it's a female that's been on the channel before that's not Joy. Samson Oak is literally everywhere. Can we just talk about that for a second? Like, why in the world is he everywhere? But no, honestly, I'm very excited. And I'm curious to see if y'all will actually figure out who it is or not. I have faith in y'all to figure it out. But I don't know. It's been years. Years on years on years on years. But, um, yeah, I'm curious. Curious what you guys will guess how well y'all will do on that. Um, do, 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 do. oh, you can go in this way. A level ball. Well, let me level. Yeah, that's pretty trash. Um, hi, Melane. I think you actually battled me. I'm all fired up. This is Melane. He controls the PC boxes. He's not the captain. I was a captain once. Thanks for visiting us. The captain, Sophocles, is such a busy young man. He's always working on the festival plaza of his. So I take this opportunity to see if you were qualified for this trial. Aha! Let's see. Are we qualified, Mr. Mullane? You're an important trainer, so you have six Pokemon. 
So hopefully we are. A Dino. Hi, Dino. We were just talking about joy, so of course Dino would appear. That's how this works. Talk about joy and a joy, like, not necessarily, it's not as bad as Jonas. Like, you talk about Jonas and a Jonas related thing just pops up on a, like, thin air. Whereas with joy, it's like, oh, you know, I just made a little reference and Dino's the first Pokemon and it's literally always Dino. <laughs> One form of Dino. It's really Dino that pops up, not joy. Um, Machamp. We, we'll go with you. Honestly, I trust Machamp to do a lot of things. I trust Malane to do a lot of things, too. I think that was level 30, right? Like, we just hit... Oh, yeah, 31s. Yep. See, it's it's definitely the game is spiking. And this is... It's finally doing what I was expecting it to do. Okay, crit doesn't matter. He didn't even attack anyway, so it's fine. Ooh, hitting me with the baneful bunker play that I've been hitting them with a lot. Honestly, good plays, good plays. Now a crit would hurt though. I think that the poison is gonna come in now. I spoke it into existence. I can speak that into existence, but I can't speak a moon into the existence. Okay. Well, shit. I knew. I knew it would hurt, too. It, it was... I, I mean, it was one of those things. It's like, oh, this would hurt if this happens. Yep, there we go. I'm not really mad about that. Like, again, I knew it would happen. I mean, it was a 4% chance. Like, I'm not mad that I took that risk. 96% of the time, that works. The 4%, it doesn't. I didn't play around the crit. That's my fault. That's, that's how it works. Um, and I, I mean, look, I literally said it too. Like, I literally said, oh, that's a problem because of why so yeah you know it's funny because of course it would happen that way but gosh stone edge and sticky webs and you have liquidation for no reason okay I mean if you want to I guess I'm not gonna just tell you you can't have that move but But yeah, we, we've hit the spike, and we have a pants age too, and the stuff is about to hit the fan, things are going to happen in a way that we don't necessarily want them to, and we got to just accept that. Um, we really do. Um, <laughs> shiny. Um, now, I will say this, I won't do an edit, because, honestly, the only edit is the thing I just did. Um, honestly, there's a lot that can go on, and this thing is, thing is could happen in a terrible direction, and so I don't want to, like, don't want to do that much editing. I'm being lazy, okay? It's 1.30 in the morning, and I have a two-hour Persona video to render, so I'm not being necessarily the most lazy. I'm just being lazy, because it's 4K. I have it set to 4K right now, and when I have it set to 4K, I... It literally takes so long to render. It takes hours to render. So it's like, I've been debating and thinking about going down to uh, 1980 by, uh, again. And I think I will do that when I go and move into Gen 8. Because I don't know Gen 8 and 9 enough to where it scares me. Whereas with these games, I kind of know my pacing and what's going on. So I can kind of just truck and do what I need to do so I can get the editing done. So yeah, I mean, there's a big difference. Knowledge is important, and you know, if you would have listened and uh, stuff, then I would have been able to actually do what I needed to do. But uh, I don't know. I I truly do not know what I want, though. You were able to complete, and you're able to complete the trial if you so choose. Yeah, I mean, my team is completely different, though. <laughs> 
There's so many Pokemon in the box. Wow. Yeah, that's a really good. That's another really good Pokemon that we just lost. I don't even know who we're gonna add. Um. Huh. Machamp. Losing Machamp is like. That's a hard hitting loss. We have a second box now of Pokemon. Holy crap. Does Trick allow me to keep the item? That becomes the question. Like. When I switch it, do I keep it? Because if I keep my, the new item, then I'm down for that. Just for the sake of searching for a freaking Moonstone and f trying to find one. Because I feel like I can. If I I will search far and wide for something for Piduck to Trick. So let's figure out how Trick works. Because if Trick works, I mean, and it's a water type. Think about it that way. It's also a water type. Piduck is a good option. Trick Pokemon. Doing research. Sorry. Trick Pokemon. Move. Nope, it does not. Trick fails if neither Pokemon has an neither Pokemon has a held item. The user is a wild Pokemon. Oh, the user is a wild Pokemon. Either Pokemon's holding a Grisius Orb. The target's behind a, a substitute. So I was wrong. Um, target's holding a sticky hold. Used in whatever tower it is. Trick no longer switches the, a trainer's Pokemon items permanently. However, items are switched in wild battles. Per, uh, yep. However, items switched in wild battles are permanently switched. Yep. Piduck. You get your ass over here, Piduck. We're finding a Moonstone in any way we can. <laughs> We're finding a damn Moonstone. I don't care. We're evolving a yay. It's going to take us some time, and it's going to be time between episodes. It doesn't matter because we're going to have to grind anyways. We're finding a damn Moonstone, and we're freaking evolving yay. Because, and I don't care, I will a route encounter, I will trick Pokemon like that, and it's happening. We're finding one. We have so much accessibility. There's no, there's literally, each, think about it this way. Each route has upwards of 20 Pokemon that I can find. I will find every Pokemon encounter and I will get that Moonstone. Will I remember what the frick I get it from? Absolutely not, but does that actually matter? No, what matters is we're getting one and it's happening and we're gonna freaking evolve yay and Piduck's gonna be the one that does it and Piduck's gonna be great, okay? We stand the Piduck. Anyways, Piduck's out of the team and yay's gonna evolve. That's doing that for the sake of his evolution <laughs> moving forward uh, like hey you know honestly Pyduck saves lives and we're frankly have a team of four all fully evolved Pokemon for the first time <sighs> wow look at that you completed Milo's trial you can get more stuff cool there's nothing here that I want other than well I hyper potions I guess Add some here, Room Palace. You don't have any. Oh, we can buy them now. Because it's not like I wouldn't use them. And then some stuff that we don't need. Okay, cool. Losing Machamp is another big loss. Um, but. I do be like that sometimes. And I'm going to actually, I am going to lead with Quivarius and have Quivarius be our lead here. Uh, 
Clovis just does a lot for us, I think. Well, I'm bourbon and stuff, I'm sorry. Very unprofessional of me. Isn't there something over here that I'm like failing to remember? Like an item or something in here that you're like, oh, there's items. Like, I guess not. Beep bop. Beep bop poop. Anyways, this is a different uh, trial. So. But it does happen in here. Totem 5, engage. Oh, wound. Did I blow a fuse? Audio quiz. Auditory quiz. That is the sound of the Pokemon Center. First encounter for this is... Oh, not bad. Not bad at all because we have an ice type. I want to I want to con conserve Quaverius's health as much as possible. And I cannot believe we're freaking finally going to do it. We're going to freaking finally evolve yay. One of these Pokémon, one of these like 600 not 600 but like 400 Pokémon are going to have to have a moonstone. Yeah, yeah, yours. <sighs> Charge bug. Not what we we're looking for, but hey, it's a Mantike. Quavarios. Dude, our team is. Just, it feels a lot different without freaking magic and daddy. The daddy magic. Um. Combination. But hey, now we have Yay, Satan, Piduck. <laughs> it's a different pairing. It's fine. The fact that you freaking. I'm so happy Piduck's. That Piduck was the star of the show in this episode. And, again, the way that trick works, um, for, again, is I'm gonna be switching items, so I won't be gaining any items from doing this. I literally just get my Moonstone and go away. <laughs> That's how that works. Get whatever, get the Moonstone, and then end my search, end my hunt. But I won't be gaining any items because of trick. So... I just don't know what I would, what am I willing to lose, like realistically. I mean, to be honest, I got pointless Pokeballs that I can just the quick balls are just doing what I need to do, so it do be like that. So I guess I'll probably lose a Pokeball or a few Pokeballs depending on how Trick works. I'll have to play with it and see, but I might be losing a lot more Pokeballs than I think I am, and if I am, I don't know how I feel about that. But it's for the sake of evolving, yay. You can actually see the, the lips thing. <laughs> it's Google. <laughs> what? What other Pokemon? What other Pokemon would we have to get through? And see before we evolve yay in the most ridiculous way freaking possible by adding a Pokemon with trick so that we can direct a moonstone. Oogle Blip's like, yeah, you're doing it by the way. I 
acknowledge the fact that you're going to evolve. Yay. It's another meme Pokemon, and we love her. Okay, Oogle Whip. I see you. Oh my god. It, it, this is like the best trifecta. Okay, like... Freaking Pyduck gets the item to evolve Yay, and Oogle Blip literally comes up and says, I approve of this message. <laughs> In the most Oogle Blip fashion, I approve of this message. Just good job. I, I for a second thought that, that was actually the totem, and that made me laugh so hard. I'm sorry. I thought that was, and I saw it didn't aura, but still. The fact that Oogle Blip still appeared. I swear, if Oogle Blip pops up again, I was like, oh, by the way, who else pops up? What other meme is going to pop up? Okay, that's not a meme. Damn. But that is still scary Pokemon. It. Well, attack plus one. We're fine. We're okay. We're chill. I don't think it's going to kill, but still. Sucker Punch. Ow! With plus one attack, that actually hurt hard. Oh, it did heal Ko. Cool. Bye. <laughs> we just whisked that away like it was nothing. Venishock. Who's earning that? <laughs> a move of her class. It's a best in class move. She's learning her final move. And it's Venishock. Oh my god, yay. I'm gonna get rid of Acid Spray because I like the 65. Actually, 40 and 80 is 120. 40, 80 is 120. 65, 65 is uh, 130. So uh, Acid Spray is going away. I think about it like this. Realistically, two Pokemon is um, what you're gonna run into. So if if you hit to kill a Pokemon in two hits, then 130 is better than 120. Plus, it becomes 130 if I find Toxic Spikes, which, I mean, I would love to have that. Big Mo, nice work, Captain. Good job. Dude, I am so thrilled by this, actually, though. I, that didn't sound like it, but yeah, let's open up Route 12 and Blush Mountain. Yeah, that's the plan. Open up Route 12, Blush Mountain, and that way we have freaking more, more areas to explore when it comes to the encounters. I don't care. We are getting this bitch evolved, okay? Watch her, like, have a terrible ability when she evolves. Let's not think that way. Think positively. Okay, we lost a daddy. We lost daddy, which allowed for us to add Pyduck, which allowed for Pyduck to trick, which allowed trick to evolve yay, which then Oogleblip approved. Story. <laughs> Daddy sacrificed himself for yay, like a good dad would. <sighs> That's where he wants the mantle to go, is to yay, like 100%. You you can't say otherwise. Like, naturally, that's where he wants the mantle. Oh, wait. We have the Guzma fight, though. So I don't think we can have access to those routes, do we? You gotta go give this to the professor and fight Guzma now. That's right. Well. Unfortunately, it is Guzma's. We can't unlock those two routes yet. But we're finding a Moonstone. We have to be. We have to, right? Like, it's gotta happen. We got healing items. We're okay. We might as well do this fight now because it's not going to be easy. We know it's not going to be easy. And if we lose a Pokemon here, then we know we got to add something. But we're so close to that 150 mark, and that's what's, that's even more nerve-wracking. It's how close we are to 150. 
or excuse me, 250. We have two episodes away from that after this. So after this fight, so we have Route 12, Blush Mount 10, and then heading to the sixth totem, and then the sixth totem is probably gonna be 250. So, yeah, not 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 optimal. But episode 249 is an encounters-based episode, so that's always that's all that's from the bottom of my heart. I'll take those. So encounter-based episode. And we pick up right where Route 12 begins, so it'll be okay. And Hawaiian roll, let's go. Ooh, don't like that. There, like I said, we, we I, I did say it. We hit the climb point, so we knew it was happening. We knew it was coming. We knew it was here. Brutal swing. I don't care. Thousand arrows. Get this guy out of here, Bry. Take care of business. Thank you, my dude. I appreciate you. I don't have a lucky egg on. I'm dumb. It's fine. I have it there for a reason. But I mean, we're leveled up enough. Bisharp. <sighs> Bishop's faster. You know we don't have Machamp. You know it'd be so great right now, Machamp. Crap! I think I think Bishop's faster than Mammo. Bishop causes so much problems that it's not really good for me to freaking fight, but it's just fine. Oh, it's really not good for me to fight. I don't have much amp, so Bishop's actually a threat. Crap. Shoop nuggets. Um. This one has become a threat. Oh, okay. And we don't have Yay either. You know, Yay would have evolved. Yay would have been great. Um, not really. It doesn't help us in this instance. I'm gonna go with trusting Balboa. Balboa is defensive, but is weak to moves. Um, but I trust Balboa's defense. That's where I'm gonna lay or put my uh, put my trust. 109 defense versus 70 is a big difference when you're talking about a super effective attack. Difference in HP is a little bit negligible, but we also have the quad weak new. Yeah. And if Balboa does go, it's not the worst thing in the world as well. We gotta think about it in that frame of mind as well. But I don't think that Balboa would go. I think Balboa takes a hit. Okay. Or trapped in. Nice. Okay. Big. But Bishop is gone. Yeah. Cool. Good play. Um, because. Um, Bry would have died in one shot. Bry would have been one shot. Ooh, who's learning what of all? Pydeck. Ten you can take it over dive. It's the same base power, and it flinches. Togunamaru. Oh. Okay, so steel is an issue for this team. Togunamaru is even worse, arguably. Ugh. The difference between... Uh, no, because Ghost is resisted. It's dragon. Yeah, Toga to Mario is arguably worse. It doesn't have the attack stat, though. I'm going to stay in. And I'm going to hope that it is not anchor shot. Because I'm gonna moo moo milk and see what it does. Iron Head's preferred. Bullet Bunch. Oh, that's totally fine. That does like 30 damage. Me saying it's totally fine and 30 damage in the same sentence didn't feel wrong at all. K. 
Okay. Another quad effective move. Also, that did 20. Okay. So it's 24 and 20. Another quad effective move. Balboa, I need you to do this. Balboa, you're taking hits, dude. If, they're sp if they were special hits, that would be scary. It would be even scarier, to be honest. Balboa wants Rock Blast. So no. Oh, I thought B would do it. Keep old moves. Cosmog. That's fine. That we can send Satan in. Cosmog's not a problem. <laughs> no problema. Well, we're stuck in, but it shouldn't matter. It's it's a cosmog. Yeah, no problem. Okay. Meow stick. I find to stay in. I don't have a qualm with that. Furfur is the last. I'm going to go into Bry on a Furfru. Bry, you can hit this Furfru. Um, I feel like you're the best equipped to handle this. I mean, Quivarius could have too very well. Could have. But... It's kind of a matter of trust at this point. And I trust I trust Bry. I think Bry's a good Pokemon. Pretty diverse set and everything too. All I think I worry about with Bry is the amount of weaknesses Bry has. But yeah, okay. Well in this next episode, episode 249, it is an encounter based episode. We have Route 12, Lush Mountain, Route 13, um, the base of the mountain, the Route 14, Route 15, six encounters. 12, 13, 14, 15, base of the mountain, and Blush Mountain. So, yeah. But, yeah, well, after this talking situation because everybody wants to talk 8,000 ages today. Uh, yeah, we'll see you guys then. Then I cannot believe that 249 is going to be that tough, but we'll meet you at the gate, hopefully with a moonstone. Um, I got a lot of work to do, so catch you later.